You're watching Gold Rush on a Russian. We're recapping the season 9 episode, Gold Gurus. So, what happened? Fair warning, everyone, this is a special episode, which means it's nothing but recaps. Better hang on, this is going to be rougher than a ride with Parker on a jet boat. In season 4, Parker visited Tony Beats and learned drill holes are important. So, drill holes are to gold mining what jets are to jet boats? In season 5, Freddie and Derek Dodge had a claim. Yeah, I remember. I was excited for Season 5 because of it, but then Discovery gave up on them to spend more time with the Hoffmans, because Discovery hates when competence is combined with success. That season, they used ground-penetrating radar to identify bedrock depth, and a drone to map the ground from the sky. Yeah, the tech is cool, but they probably could have done the same thing with a jet boat. In all honesty, all these segments reminded me is how awesome Freddy is, and how ridiculous it is that Discovery isn't following his every movement. Alert the press, fuel bills are expensive, and mobile conveyors are more efficient than dozers and rock trucks. We watch Parker build his custom super conveyor faster than a jet boat can overturn onto a mining mechanic. In Season 7, Team Hoffman had a problem with a giant useless boulder in their way. Just one? I remember there being about a dozen. They drill a hole in one and blow it up with dynamite. Hey, I remember that demolitions guy. He was fun crazy, like a flaming chainsaw boomerang. And not dumb crazy, like, you know, racing jet boats in a gold mine. In all honesty, this segment reminds me how bad the Hoffmans were in the later seasons. Constantly racing around, making promises of big gold and helmet tapping. I thought I missed it, but now I realize I don't. In Season 4, the Hoffmans headed to mine the desert in South America, and Freddy built a wash plant with plywood, 2x8s, and plastic pipe. We get it, Freddy is awesome. He's also good at making gold recovery tables. Yeah, but can he build a jet boat? We learn again that mammoth tusks are a sign of good gold. No word on what a wrecked jet boat is a sign of. To remove the impurities from gold, it has to be refined to remove slag. To remove the impurities from gold rush, it has to be edited to remove jet boats. Tune in next time when jet boats. <laughs> well, this was <laughs> this is one of the dumber ideas I've had. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Tune in next time for a real episode, not this. Although, what's the definition of a real episode these days? I don't even know. Until next time, you can leave a comment below, subscribe, like. It helps the channel, and I'll see you next week.